The bell rings for students to go to their next class, something that all of us are used to doing. But now we aren't the only ones that have to go from class to class. Teachers are running down the hallways as well, trying to beat the bell. With 1,765 students, most of us expected portables to be somewhere on campus. But the Roseville Joint Union High School District saved $100,000 by deciding to have teachers switch classrooms. This has many advantages, such as saving jobs, according to Assistant Principal Rob Hasty. However, there are also a few disadvantages. Algebra teacher Deborah Love is one of the many teachers affected by this new system. You're setting up as students are walking in so you don't have that ability to greet students as they come into the classroom or to have any kind of um, initial warm-up to get them started working when the bell rings because on occasion the computer and the smart board by the time you get logged on and everything warmed up it takes time. English teacher Allison War also has a hard time setting up her class when she has to switch classrooms but tries her best to make it work. The hardest part is just the transition, um, running like the students from class to class and trying to set up so when the bell rings, class starts. And now it's not that easy because it takes time to log into my computer, hook everything up, put the journal on, put every, you know, so there's always a couple extra minutes that are wasted, I guess, um, on the transition. Lindsay Crosby has a hard time getting her class organized and finds it difficult to talk to her students that need help. It takes longer to get organized, so we're always, I'm always running five or ten minutes behind my lessons now. And then it's difficult to find a place to talk to the kids now that I have second period prep and only one lunch instead of third and lunch being combined. I always have to make sure that they know where I'm at. A lot of kids can't find me, and if they do find me, they find me in the middle of walking from one class to the other, and I can't talk at that point. Although teachers have a hard time getting ready to teach before the bell rings, some teachers like the idea of switching classrooms. The majority of the reaction has been positive about the collaboration rooms um, and the ability for teachers to interact with one another um, and collaborate about instruction and curricular practices that are going on on campus. Depending on how the new system works out this year, we might never see portables on campus and teachers will continue to switch classrooms until more room is needed benefits outweigh you know the negatives so to speak uh, with the whole process in addition to that we need to you know as we continue to grow as a school look at the number of students we have on campus you know at some point the current facilities that we have will be maximized um, and when they're maximized at some point there, there could potentially be a need for a portable be on campus um, whether or not we're implementing this practice or not that need may be there at some point with 60 classrooms and 78 teachers the school doesn't have enough room and teacher switching classes eliminates the need for portables. I'm Crystal Campos reporting for Channel 5 Titan TV News.